Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Scratch Guy, and this time I'm gonna show you how to make a mobile friendly game on Scratch. So basically, there are uh, many types of mobile friendly games like um, button control, joystick control, and uh, touch control, and uh, many more. So we are gonna make the button control, and I'm gonna see that how many controls are there. So this time in this video. I'm gonna make the button control so just what you need to do is go to paint strike and uh, zoom it till 200% take the rectangle and uh, just make a square and it shouldn't be filled it should be hollow like that all right and it should be filled with the gray color which is actually not the darkest shade it's a bit down one shade backward so like this um and uh, now take the black color and take the line just draw a line like this one like this one like this oops one line okay just leave it like this and so we have that and what you need to do is just shrink it in size so this much so that's great and what you need to do is just to make four copies of it okay duplicate it four times this is actually what we are going to do that. and now just flip it over which is the back button and just to select it whole rotate it all right okay like that okay rotate it so like that and this one I think I have done a mistake by making this one what you need to do is duplicate the left part and just flip it over this is the right part all right okay so now let's get back to the code so first take the ops right this is the one so when clicked Go to, but first, what we are gonna do is just to, um, uh, before coding, we are gonna set up it like a gaming pad, just like in the Super Mario Bros. it does. So, just to run like this, I suppose. And another one like this all right so here it's it and uh, right okay I think just shrink it once more just twice you have to shrink everyone just try doing this so basically I'm using my tab Android device and um, and this time it's right I think I shouldn't waste time on this but setting up it's important so that we could get the position ready and the square positions and obviously do it in a full screen mode because everyone uses the full screen mode in the scratch so and check so when clicked do to x negative 140 y negative 15 but before that set size to 75 percent everywhere everyone is set size to 75 percent do x negative 140 y negative 15 and then forever back 
forever if and operator all right the and operator hmm touching mouse pointer in the left side okay touching mouse pointer in the left side and mouse down on the right side if touching mouse pointer and mouse down but cast a message called so basically the name of the message is up just put it broadcast up over there so now this same this coding is same for everyone okay all right I put event quit set size to 75 percent this one also and in motion downwards go to x negative 140 y negative 142 and in the left part go to x negative 203 y negative 80 <coughs> now they here also in the right one go to x negative 76 y negative 78 but we are not done okay in the downwards we are gonna broadcast a message and the name of the message is down all right put it the down here and in the left one we are going to broadcast a new message. So the name of the message is left. And this and the right one. The name of the message is right. So uh, we are done. But not. But the coding of this is done. So we are going to make a player. Alright. Just a red dot. Actually red looks cool a bit cool so i'm using the red all right and make sure that you have used something re really really important that it's set ghost effect 2 yes the set ghost effect 25 which i'm gonna tell so set ghost effect to 25 no set ghost effect in the world and all so Put it right over here and this much coding we are gonna put it everywhere so because and just take it out put the set close effect till there here also take it out put this over there here also take it out and set close effect to here so this this way we have all this transparent so that we could see the background too let me check all right yeah we could see the background yeah we could see the background so but the coding is not till complete now when clicked Go to X, Y, wherever, wherever it is. Okay, so that we could see it. We are going to put it here. We do X, 98 by 71. Well, you don't need to remember it. And now when I receive, when I receive, when I receive. Just four times. Up, down, left, and then right. All right. So, okay. So, but change x by ten in the right side. Change y by ten in the up. 
but in this one change y by in the down and in the x too but there's something twist all right in the down and in the left we have put it my change x and y by minus 10 obviously we you don't need to remember this so our button control is complete so let's see if it works or not all right yeah look at that okay something is left I think so go back one layers and this is very very important so that it may look like the player is already but you can also put go to front on anything on everyone but I want to I don't want to waste time all right as you can see we have made our own mobile friendly game on the button screen so thanks for watching guys see you soon in my next video goodbye